What's up everyone? Today we're going to be creating a Black Friday ad. Black Friday ads are made simple with Wii Video. Today we're going to show you how. Here's how this is going to work. Tyler's going to create a Black Friday video ad on the spot. I'm going to give him a couple of specs beforehand and criteria, and he's going to take it from there. Sound good? That's good. All right. So we're going to be creating a 15 second video ad for YouTube. This will be played as a non-skippable ad over the beginning of other YouTube videos. This will be for a furniture company. It will be a 60% off promotion over Black Friday weekend. Sound good? Great. All right, let's hop right into Wii Video and get started. Let's see if we can remember all those specs and make this happen. So I'm in the template library here. You can see a bunch of different options for templates. We're going to go ahead and filter this down to the business promos. We know we want to make a furniture ad today, but that doesn't necessarily mean we have to find a furniture template because we will be able to customize these and make them our own. So you can hover over top to preview some of these templates and get an idea for what you're going to use. So let's find one that's kind of engaging. This guy looks kind of interesting. Just click in, select the project that you'd like to edit in, and click Start Editing. OK, so let's play this just so we have an idea of what we're working with, and then we can start customizing this template to make our ad. All right, that's looking good, pretty straightforward. Obviously, we're going to want to replace this clip, so let's start there. I'm going to go into the stock media library, and we know we want to find some furniture, but let's find something that's kind of engaging. Maybe we could have some kids jumping on the new furniture. A avoid excited. the warranty, but yeah, <laughs> let's get something along there. All right, so in the stock media library, you can click on the different clips to preview them. When you find one you like, this one looks pretty good. You can simply drag and drop onto the template. We're going to be replacing this clip. So when I let go, you can see that it has replaced that clip entirely and filled it within the timeline. So very simple process to replace clips. Now we can go in and start making changes to the text as well. So the copy for this actually works pretty well, I think. We might want to add in our uh, promotion at the end here. But for now, let's just start changing some of these colors. I feel like that red clashes a bit with our background. So let's double click in and real quickly, this is where you would change the actual copy, the font, the sizing, and then finally the colors. So let's change this red to something closer to that wall in the background. I think that'll look nice. So you can click on these different swatches. And you can also use this color wheel here to really dial it in. I think a little bit lighter just to offset a bit. That looks pretty good. All right, and when you find a color that you like, a good tip is to copy this hex code here. And then we can use that on different motion titles in our project. So let's go to this one. You can see I already copied that color code go into the green and we're going to paste that color code here and then we just have a nice uniform color across each one of these titles great now i know we want to add in the black friday 60 percent off so this is where we would save those changes and we're going to go into this top text here and let's change this to our 60% off. Black 
Friday weekend. Beautiful. You can also use this transform tab here and we can change the placement of this text, the scaling as well, depending on your format, what you want to see. You don't have to stick to the format that you started out with. We can actually go in and add new clips. So let's search furniture again. Let's find something that's going to let that text pop. I think this couch close up is going to work. So we really want our viewer to see this text. And that close up of the couch is working nicely, in my opinion. So, And let's add a nice logo in there. In my media, I've already loaded up my logo for this furniture company. And loading media is as simple as importing and then dragging in to the timeline. We can cut using S. And we can't see the logo quite yet, so let's add a background. Solid. I think white will work good. Let's drag this over. We're going to extend this out. We could actually extend this couch clip a bit too. Be sure we're getting that sale. And you can extend your music. So our opacity button, click here. You can add a fade in seconds here, or you can simply create a new keyframe by clicking on that line and then dragging it down. And now we have a nice fade in of our logo to end off our ad. So those are just some tips. Let's go ahead and play this out and see what it's looking like. Awesome, love it. 15 second ad created in about five minutes. 30% of all retail sales occur between Black Friday and Christmas. And I think this will help us deliver. Thank you for joining us, everyone. If you have any questions or comments, let us know in the comment section below and we'll catch you in the next one. Happy creating.